Ollie, the train. There are all sorts of objects in the clearing. Kids, do you know what they are called? That's right. These are geometric shapes. Oh, I know. These are blocks. Yes, these geometric shapes with the volume are blocks and spheres. They are also called solid geometric objects. That's right, Ollie. Because these shapes have a volume, which means they take up space. For example, you can use blocks to build a tower. Ollie, what do we call the shape that looks like blocks? This shape is called a block. Ollie and Emma, what do you think? What shape does the block look like? Like a square. That's right, like a square. Just remember that a square is one side of a block and is a plain shape, while a block is a solid. How many sides does a block have? Count it for us, Ollie. One, two, three, four, five, six. Now let's think. What shape does a sphere look like? Like a circle. Oh! That's right, like a circle. Remember, a circle is a plain shape, while a sphere is a solid. What objects look like a sphere? A ball, an apple, balloons. That's right. Good job. Now take a closer look and tell me what's the difference between a circle and a square. The square has corners. The circle doesn't. That's right. They have a different number of corners. A square has four corners. One, two, three, four. What's the difference between a sphere and a block? They have different corners. That's right. The sphere can roll around. A block has corners and stands still. And we can build a tower out of blocks. Exactly. Good job, you two.